Sarah GP, not only are we racing on the water to win, we're racing for our planet in the Impact League. And this is a league where points are awarded to teams for innovative ideas to help reduce our carbon footprint and help protect the world we live in and the planet we race on. The key to this is collaboration between the teams. So every time a team comes up with an idea, we can implement it across the whole event and we can make, reduce our carbon footprint as we go around the world. So I'll run through a few ideas and a few things that the teams have come up with, which we then implemented across all our teams. So the French, for instance, they've started weighing the waste. It means we can reduce how much we throw away and recycle correctly. The Spanish, they've helped introduce environmentally friendly boat wash, which has been implemented across all the teams now. It gets used every day as you wash the boats down. The Danish, they have a podcast where they help spread the word and educate local people everywhere we go to help spread the word about what we're doing and educate on what we're going to be doing in each local venue. The Australians, they've introduced a chase boat box rule, which means that the chase boats no longer have to follow the boats burning lots of fuel. Uh, we stay in a chase box close to the middle of the racing area where we can operate safely and reduce our output in terms of fuel costs. The Americans, they've helped introduce a foiling first program. This will help uh, bridge the gap in the sport and help introduce people into the sport at a young age. New Zealanders, they've done a really innovative product reducing our use of Kleiser. This is a plastic single-use product that we use all the time in every event. Uh, so we've replaced that where we can, which means we can reuse it everywhere we go. So that's a huge and great project that's been running out throughout the season. The Japanese, they've been working to reduce our craning time. So the cranes operate daily to get all the boats in and out of the water. So the amount of time we can spend on the crane, if we can drop that down, it'll help reduce our diesel emissions and again, help reduce our carbon footprint. These are just some of the ways that GP and all the teams are working together to help make a positive impact everywhere we go.